Are you smarter than a ninth grader? So here we have. Amanda Short. John Freed. Barry. Coach Gresham. Karen Pope. Baylor Smith. The first one is name five young adult novels. Harry Potter, Maze Runner. Uh... Harry Potter, uh, Lord of the Rings, uh, Twilight. Uh, Magic Trios. That's that? middle school. That's middle school. Empire, Empire Diaries. Diaries. Does that count? Uh, he said it counted. Okay. The entire Harry Potter series and also all the Twilight books. There's five right there. Okay. The summer I turned pretty. If you're in a race and pass the person in second, what place are you in? Second. Second. Yes. Second. Win. Second. What formula is used to solve a graph? Why, why does it make so easy? She didn't even go know what that is. Slope <laughs> form? Is yeah. that it? Yeah. But what, what, is, but what is it? Oh, I have no idea. Why equals MC squared? Name all of the Kardashians. <laughs> she did get it first. Kim, we have Courtney, we have Chloe, we have Rob, and then we have the Jenners, Kylie, and Kendall. Do I have to keep going? Like with their babies, like the whole fam? No, that's it. I got you. I know what she looks like. I can't think of her name right now. Kim Kardashian and her weird three ex-husbands. They all start with K. Kim, Kylie, Kendall, Courtney, and Chloe. Mm, that, that no <laughs> Who is dating Taylor Swift? <laughs> Travis Kelsey. Travis Kelsey. Yeah. <laughs> Travis Kelsey. Yeah. <laughs> Who is Taylor Swift dating? <laughs> oh, that was really. We'll have to replay that. <laughs> What do, you, what, do you, what do you think about losing to, to a ninth grader? Okay. Uh, to, my, to my ninth grade student, to my ninth grade student that's actually a junior that I almost beat, I feel like it was a little biased because like, there's a whole generation age gap, but I still know who Taylor Swift is dating and all the Kardashians. You lose. It's all right. I was going to let him give, get the win anyways. Hey. hey. I'll take a dub however I can get it. I really didn't want y'all to pick Baylor because I knew he was going to win. <laughs> Hello Bears, it's Maddie, and we're back with interviews today. Today we're going to be talking about Valentine's Day and asking people their best pickup line and if they have a Valentine. <laughs> what is your best pickup line? Ask John. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, oh, wait. Uh, are you from Tennessee? Did you go to Tennessee? <laughs> that was really, really Thank good. You Thank so you much. so much. I thought it was pretty lit. Oh, didn't. I've heard better. Do you have a Valentine? No, I do not. Do you want a Valentine? Yes. Get this man a valentine right now, please. Do you have a valentine? Uh, no, I do not. Find this man a valentine right now. What's your name? Uh, my name's Todd. Get Todd a valentine. Lane, what is your best pickup line? What? What's your best pickup line? Hey, cutie. What are you doing? That it? Oh, the, the wink. <laughs> Thank you so much. The wink is what gets them. What is your best pickup line? Oh my god. Oh, Are you the Kool-Aid man? Cause oh yeah. <laughs> what? Is that good? What's y'all's names? I'm Emily. Hi. Aaliyah. What is your best pickup line? Okay. Do you live in Tennessee? Cause you're the only 10 I see. Oh nah, not the cut off. <laughs> okay. I hope you guys have a fantastic Valentine's Day. Oh yeah, you too. Thank you. That's it for our Valentine's interviews today, guys. Yeah. We'll be back with you soon. You. Love you so much. See you later. Welcome back to The Bachelor. How are you feeling before these first dates? Uh, you know, I'm excited. Uh, excited to see uh, what these girls are like. Uh, excited to see, you know, what they kind of have to offer, you know? What's your type? Um, probably someone who's, like, kind of down to earth. You know, obviously someone who's pretty. Someone who uh, has a lot of respect, is caring. You know, really funny, too. Let's watch the first dates. Hi. Hi, I'm Jake. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, well, so to start off, like, what do you like to do? Um, so I don't really do much, but um, my dad takes me to the country club every single afternoon. And I like to hang, I like do the yacht club sort of thing. It's kind of ah. small, like it could be better, you know, like. How do you think your date with Samantha went? 
Uh, Samantha, I think it went well. She's really nice, a uh, great person. Uh, the problem is, I don't think I can afford her. How do you think your first date went? I thought it was kind of weird. Like, I think it was okay because, well, all the men that I've talked to before usually wear, like, three-piece suits, and he wasn't wearing that. So, like, it was kind of weird. And then I also noticed he was wearing, like, his wrists were empty. Like, he didn't have any... He didn't even have a Rolex watch. Like, I feel like that's, like, if you stoop low enough, like, you could at least, like, put a Rolex on. But, like... Do you have any, like, interests or, like, anything that, like... I love shopping. Um, I kind of shop at, like, the smaller known stores. Kind of, oh, okay. like... I'm I'm very like down to earth like everyone else. Like oh, I, I like good. Gucci and like Louis Vuitton. Like those are kind of like the basic stores that like my dad like lets me go on like the weekends. But like yeah, for sure. I don't know. Yeah. Like I kind of like that and like oh, I do. You know what I do? Like, I do like cars. Do you? No, I do. Like How many Porsches do you have? I, I drive a Tacoma. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Jake. I'm Kyle. Hi. So what do you like to do? Um. Mostly read people's palms or go barefoot walking in the forest. Oh, yeah, yeah that sounds not. Do you not? Do your feet not hurt after? No, not at all. I don't feel anything. How do you think your date with Kyle went? Uh, absolutely awful. Um, it was not good. She's not down to earth. She's very out of touch with reality, quite frankly. Um, also, I don't know how her feet don't hurt. I mean, like she makes barefoot walks through the forest. I'm pretty sure I saw a stick hanging out of her pinky toe. What are some of your interests, some things you like to do? Mostly just read people's auras. What color would you say your aura is? I don't know, like blue, maybe? Mm. I don't... I would have said orange. Orange? How do you think the first date went? I think it went amazing. I think he would actually go barefoot walking with me in the forest one day. The only thing I had a problem with, his aura was a little off, and I didn't like that. Uh, I guess she's not coming. What happened with Riley's date? That's a great question. I was hoping you could tell me. Nothing happened. She didn't even show up. So, I mean, if she's just not interested, she doesn't even need to be here. Hey, I'm Kylie. Uh, nice to meet you, MJ. Nice to meet you. What do you like to do? Uh, I like Instagram. I'm like an influencer, you know. How many followers do you have? Oh, only like 514. Oh, I have a million. Oh, oh gosh. Actually. Let's take a picture for it. Oh, I don't. Are you on? sure? I don't. Yes. Okay. How do you think your first date went? Um, I think it went okay, but he doesn't really have as many followers as I thought he was gonna. But it's okay. I can get him there just by posting him. But I took a picture with him because I think it would be good for the Instagram. And he wasn't really photogenic, and that might be a problem. How do you think your date with Kylie went? Uh. It went all right. Um, a little weird that she wanted to take a selfie with me on the first date, uh, but I did get some Instagram followers from it though, so I'll take it. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Jake. Howdy, I'm Maddie. <laughs> Howdy. Howdy. <laughs> Howdy. Um, what What do you like to do? Um, I like to ride horses and do things like that. I live in the country, so. Oh, do you? Yeah. How's that? It's It's good until my horse Pickles died. Oh. Yeah. Oh, God. It was really sick. It was really twisted. And it was just, I just couldn't do it. It just really hurt me and my soul. Yeah. And so I just, That's... I, sorry. No, it's this is just a really it's... hard for me to deal with. How do you think your first date went? It went horrible. He reminded me of my horse Pickles and it was just really hard for me to even think about it again. But I hope, I hope he gives me another chance because I really do believe he could be my hubby. How do you think your date with Maddie went? Uh... It was a hot mess, um, but I liked the way she was in touch with her feelings. Uh, so it shows that she can be emotional if needed. Hi, Jake. Hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, the dap up was crazy. Yeah, I'm I'm sort of the dap up type. Are you? Are yes. You really? Oh, okay. Yes, you know we do a lot of that with at, at Disneyland. Mm, no, at Disneyland, you. So you go to Disneyland? I after? go to Disney. <laughs> I love Disney. <laughs> I love me some Disney. How did your date with Nicole go? I thought it went great. Uh, she was very talkative, very interested in talking to me. Uh, only problem is, I think she has more hair on her chin than I do. So I don't, I'm a little suspicious, but that's uh, right.
<laughs> What's your favorite Disney movie? What's your favorite Disney movie? The Princess and the Frog. The Princess and the Frog. Mm. Why, why is that? I love the the scene, you know, when they're going in the in the in the river. But you know, I don't support them taking Splash Mountain out. I know Princess oh. and the Frog is my favorite movie, but you know, change Splash Mountain to the Princess and the Frog. Mm. Mm. Yeah, you only think. <sighs> nope. So how do you think your Awful. first date went? It was, it was not, mm -mm. the love for Disney was not on the same level as my own. Um, he didn't further the, the discussion of the Splash Mountain topic. And that was just, just a really red flag. So tune in next week to see who's cut.